Alright, so a lot of these deer, this is the bedding ground right here. But we'll set up over here, we'll watch the football field, which is just basically a long, long alfalfa field here. And these <clears throat> these deer will come out of the out of the west and out of the south and they'll come and they'll feed in this football field. We'll just go out there and, and glass and see if we can find a, a nice buck for these two guys. Well, that's awesome. Thanks, Jeff. Appreciate yeah. you having us out here today. TJ, what's the word you would use to describe your feelings this morning? Uh, yeah, we'll say extremely excited. That's two words again. Yep. I mean, you're going to come back within five hours and I'm going to want a single word response. So we're going to revisit this. <laughs> I've got it, but it depends on how you spell it. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hear it. Fucking A. <laughs> F A W K I N A Y. Huh, there you go. Yeah. Fucking A. <laughs> All right, so I don't know if y'all heard the game plan. <clears throat> so, so, so y'all ready? I mean, we we've been game planning over here, but straight in front of us, there's this little narrow finger of cedars. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna get right up on the edge of those cedars. On the back side of it, there's an alfalfa field. And so it's kind of the sweet spot, right? It is the honey hole. So these muleys ought to be moving from this side over here. They ought to be coming from a, from above, and we're going to be really right beside a big bedding area. So uh, the opportunity to see a lot of animals this morning is going to be extremely high, extremely high. So we're going to be sneaking right up in there here in just a few. Uh, we're going to be working our way around, and then we'll get set up and see what we can find. All right, sweet. Sounds like a plan. Oh, it is a plan. <laughs> <laughs> it is a plan. It's late October and the Brotherhood Outdoors crew was in Colorado on a first season mule deer hunt with Jeff Musgrave of Western Outdoors Adventures. Mark Conroy, a business manager with Roofers Local 96, was selected by the Union Sportsman's Alliance, who then in turn chose to book a hunt for his son-in-law, T.J. Delaney. Two Minnesota boys toting rifles through the mountains of Colorado. Now that's a recipe for fun. You know, there's some nice deer out there. We just have to catch them at the right time. I have a feeling this evening hunt, it's, it's gonna be productive. So, that is what it is. And the altitude definitely kicked my backside. <laughs> That's all I got. All right, folks, we, we got up the hill here. We saw some beautiful muleys way out. Uh, we saw probably a 150, 160 class, uh, way out, probably a thousand yards out. And the way he was moving, I think we might be in the right spot just to be here in the afternoon. So we're gonna go take a little break, get a little lunch, and then we're gonna come back and have some fun. Do, 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 and do. All does. All those and fronts. So we'll keep an eye on these cedars because that buck that went in there this morning, he might just come right back over here this afternoon. 100%. Yeah, so the wind's in our favor, dry out of our face. I think uh, we might be on a, a good evening hunt. I think it's going to be a great evening hunt. Yeah. Be optimistic, right? Always optimistic. We're in the right place for it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nice and temperatures are getting cooler. It was a little warm today, so that's probably why we saw them to go back to bed pretty early this morning. Mm -hmm. 
all the other um, all the other properties were having the seeing the same stuff. So that's good, but that's your other right. Yeah. Yeah, right behind us, right here. Right, right behind us. Yeah. Out of Meeker, we just scooped out two really nice bucks. They're probably a thousand yards out. We're about to make the walk and see if we can get close enough to get a shot here this afternoon. They're kind of going into some nice scrub. A lot of this gambrel oak gets about 10 to 15 foot high. They're going to be moving through that, a little bit of sage. So we're gonna sneak down this line and see how close we can get to them. Beautiful day. About 55 degrees. And our guys are pumped up. Beautiful afternoon, the wind's in our face. Everything you want is lining up. If we can just sneak up on them, it's gonna be money. As the saying goes, the best laid plans of mice and men often go awry, and in a matter of seconds, the wind switches 180 degrees and blows out the valley. No shot, no more deer, nothing to do but watch the sunset and hope for better luck tomorrow. Coming up next week on Brotherhood Outdoors. Turn on the side of the hill. Yeah. Right below the first. Yep.